Yes. 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 Definitely. No. In today's world, artificial intelligence is advancing at an incredible pace. And one idea that's capturing everyone's attention is the AI singularity. This concept suggests that there might come a time in the future when artificial intelligence becomes super intelligent and even smarter than humans. Ray Kurzweil, a well-known futurist and Google's director of engineering, predicts that the singularity could happen by 2045. Well, Ray Kurzweil's predictions are not just ordinary statements. He is the one who predicted ChatGPT way back in 1999. We are learning how to master language. Uh, this particular program, you can give it commands in natural language. You can tell it how to format the document. You don't have to say it in a specific hard syntax. You can say it in your own words. Back in 1999, when many thought advanced AI would take over a century to develop, he said it would take about 30 years. Today, the rapid progress in computing power supports his predictions. The performance of computers for the same price doubles roughly every 15 months, making powerful AI tools like LLMs possible. He believes the process has already begun and expects technological singularity to take over many human jobs by then. But what exactly is singularity AI? And that's the singularity where we can't even imagine Right, that's why we call it the singularity. It's a singularity in physics. Something gets sucked into its singularity and you can't tell what's going on in there because no information can get out of it. There's various problems with that, but that's the idea. It, it's, too, uh, it's too much beyond what we can imagine. The singularity is when AI merges with humans and creates a super intelligent hybrid. Imagine having your brain connected to the internet, like having a smartphone in your head. You could access information instantly without even realizing it. This merge will happen through brain-computer interfaces, eventually involving tiny robots or nanobots that enter our brains non-invasively. Elon Musk's company Neuralink is already working on it. If you want to watch the full video, click on the I button. Well, Ray Kurzweil has been a big name in artificial intelligence for a long time and has written many famous non-fiction books regarding the future of AI. In one of his popular books, The Singularity is Near, which he wrote in 2005, he made some bold predictions that seemed like science fiction at that time. He said that by 2029, computers would reach the same level of intelligence as humans. He also predicted that by 2045, humans and computers would merge, leading to a state he called the Singularity. Almost 20 years later, Kurzweil has a new book, The Singularity is Nearer, and many of his once wild predictions now seem more plausible. In a recent interview, he discussed his ideas and explained that The Singularity is Near was about the future of AI at a time when most people didn't even understand what AI was. Now, with AI being a hot topic, he thought it was time to revisit his predictions, but to your surprise, he hasn't changed his timeline. In fact, he still believes that by 2029, AI will achieve human-level intelligence, meaning it will match the skills of the most talented humans in various fields. This includes the ability to perform tasks like writing Oscar-winning screenplays or making deep philosophical insights, although some areas might take a bit longer. He also believes that, by the same time, we will have artificial general intelligence as well, an AI that can do everything any human can do, but better. At this point, you might be wondering if is that even possible, as 2029 is just five years away. Well, five years ago, we didn't have LLMs like ChatGPT and Sora either, so who knows what could happen in the next five years. So, what's there that we are missing to reach 2029? In my opinion, to get to where Kurzweil predicts AI will be in 2029, we need more computing power, which is on the way. This will help improve AI's contextual memory, common sense, and social skills, which are the areas where AI still struggles. Better algorithms and more data are also crucial. The issue of AI hallucinations, like producing incorrect or nonsensical information, will also decrease as AI becomes smarter and more aware of its own knowledge limits. To me, another aspect of Kurzweil's predictions could be transhumanism, 
as he is widely known for his ambitious views on immortality. He believes that by the 2030, medical nanobots will repair our bodies, which will potentially allow us to live indefinitely. And by the 2040, we'll be able to upload our minds to digital platforms, which will help create digital replicas of ourselves. Kurzweil isn't as worried about technological inequality as other AI experts like Elon Musk and Jeffrey Hinton are. See, Ray Kurzweil's prediction for artificial superintelligence uh, is 2029. He's not far wrong. Yeah, it depends. If some people want to live forever or for a much longer period of time and they see AI as the only way to, or, or digital superintelligence as, as the only thing that can figure out how to get them to live forever, I think Kurzweil is in that category. So he would prefer to have AI, artificial general intelligence, than, than not uh, because it can figure out longevity. He views the singularity as a chance for human advancement. He believes humans will benefit from the same technologies that enhance AI intelligence. For example, Parkinson's patients already have computers inside them, showing how cybernetics is becoming part of our lives. But the question that we need to ask here is, will the singularity happen? Well, people have mixed feelings about the singularity. Some are scared, while others see it as a positive change. It could lead to a scenario where human brains are cloned or placed into robots, allowing a person to live forever. Some believe machines might design and control robots that could dominate the planet, focusing solely on their goals, without considering the impact on people, the environment, or social norms. One big reason to fear the AI singularity is the unpredictable consequences. Even the smartest AI researchers might not be able to predict what these super intelligent systems will do. Well, what do you think? Share your thoughts and check out these videos on your screen for more interesting AI-related content.